Hello, everybody, and a good evening. It's uh, it's Thursday afternoon when I'm filming this. I wanted to just really quickly say hello to everybody. I know that you you haven't heard much from me this last week, uh, as I think probably most of you are aware. My wife and I and our family were were moving, and we are getting settled in to the uh, to the new house, and uh, it's a uh, Thank you very much to everybody who has been so encouraging to us and uh, the folks who've uh, been able to, to help us and people that have provided some food for us. Thank you very much for your support. I, it's such a weird time to be separated from each other, but uh, I'm encouraged by all the ways that we can still show love for each other. And we feel uh, very much loved by you all. I do have a, uh, a special surprise for you. Here that I wanted to show you. So I wanted to show you something new in the office. Right down the hallway here, you find Pastor Bruce Baxley in Hello. his office. Hey, Bruce. Hello, Pastor Charlie. Hello, Bruce. <laughs> hey. I wanted to show everybody that you really are here and you really are getting situated. A bit. With all of your books, lovely brother. It's a work in progress. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure it will be for some time. Yeah. How has the move been for you? It's been good. I would say it's been one of the most uh, physically and mentally exhausting <laughs> experiences I've ever tried, but it all it all worked well, and we're we're pretty much in the house. All of our stuff Excellent. has been delivered, and everything's been loaded in. Now we just got to put it where it goes. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. I think I know exactly how you feel. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> are you uh, you guys content there for now? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We love the house. We love the church property and being able to explore around here. So the girls have been playing, uh, looking all around the fields and uh, loving having extra space in the house that we can spread out. So we're doing well. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. Hey, tell, uh, tell us how to pray for you as a church right now. Uh, I guess right now, just pray that we can... Um, just get settled in well. We've still got a lot of things to put away in the house and uh, we need to get caught up on sleep. Uh, just get into a regular rhythm and routine where Andrea can continue doing her homeschooling now that we're in a different situation and meet obviously to get settled in and get a regular routine. But um, but overall, I mean, it's a praise. We're we're happy to be here. We're glad we can move in the middle of a, of a virus outbreak. And uh, so we're just excited to get started. So a lot of it's a praise. The Lord has, has blessed and watched over us and um, provided for us, but still kind of tired right now. Amen. Well, yeah. I can understand, brother. Yeah. But we will absolutely pray for you. you. Thank you. And Appreciate we are glad you. that you guys are here. Thank you. Looking forward yeah. to getting to seeing everybody in person eventually. I'm sure. <laughs> and I'm looking I'll, forward to seeing you. Let me say you. thank you to the many that came by and honked. Thank you for the many that have brought us meals and dropped off little gift baskets. We, we really appreciate all of the... The show of, of, of love and affection and everything from everyone. Oh, good. Or it was hospitality, an, I guess. Is it was an unorthodox show, but I'm glad. Right. It was good. It was good. <laughs> good. Well, brother, I'm going to let you get back to it. You look like you got some work to do here. All right. Thank you. Looks on the floor. Thank you. Yep. And friends, while I showed you something new, I'm also going to show you something old. <laughs> look who's out here. Hey, brother. How are you? Doing well. And you? Doing well. Doing well. You working hard out here? Working hard to keep y'all busy. That's right. That's exactly right. <laughs> <laughs> so as you can see, life continues uh, here in the office. It's not like it used to be. Uh, and Grace Church is a much more quiet place than I think probably it has been in years. Uh, but I know uh, that the Lord has, he's made us a family and he's keeping us a family together. So uh, we continue praying for each other. We continue searching the scriptures and continue waiting on him for the end of all this.